Yo, what up guys? Welcome to Trey TV. Checking out Legends of Tomorrow tonight. Episode 7 up in here. So let's go ahead and just see what kind of mischief we get into this episode. I love you, Rip. Go ahead, Jonas. He's listening. Hi, Daddy. We miss you. And oh, man. He got this thing on loop. I'm sorry to interrupt, Captain. I don't no, think that's uh, healthy. Just... Uh... <laughs> System malfunction. I'm stranded. Unable to jump, the controls unresponsive. This is Captain Eve Baxter of the time ship Acheron requesting critical rescue. Okay, could be a trap. The sooner we end Savage, the sooner I get back to where I belong. Oh. Prison? Any prison on Earth is better than this one, Professor. <laughs> prison. Yes, sir. <laughs> Engines to full throttle. Space range is dying. Yeah, I don't see it. I wanted to travel through space. Surviving only by my wits and laser guns. <laughs> I even built a rocket out of cardboard boxes. Huh, a regular Han Most Solo. Okay. You might want to grab hold of something. Yes, I am. It's called a gun. Oh, open the airlock, huh? Gamma Delta hatch open. Explosive decompression has evacuated the time pirates. You could learn a thing or two from her, Lieutenant Hunter. <laughs> hmm. Oh. Uh, um, Declan was right. Teach me more. Is that his wife? <laughs> <laughs> to quote every Star Wars ever made, I got a bad feeling about this. <laughs> they do love referencing Star Wars in this show. Damn, trap. Trap. Come on, man. What you got? Oh. Let the man go. Protocol that said another time master would come to a rescue. Hmm. Do I look like a time master to you? <laughs> you look like the kind of man who throws his grandmother out of an airlock. <laughs> Nor am I a time master, <laughs> so you might as well just let us go. Yeah. Captain's log, stardate 837.9. We're waiting word from the away team. Now the Star Trek. I hate to break okay. it to you, but you know Captain Kirk. I'd like to speak to acting Captain Raymond Palmer. Rick may Captain turn on them. Sound of that. Those sounds just like Star Trek, yeah. Who are you? I'm the man holding your crew hostage. We are on the move and preparing to fire. Oh, space battles now? Right. Definitely. <laughs> Great Scott. Captain's orders. Palmer, idiot. They need to stop. <laughs> The pirates who've taken the rest of the boarding party. taking everybody catchphrase. What are you doing? Where are you guys going? To deal with the hole in the ship. Okay. Sure Picard here doesn't get us all killed. Actually, more like Sulu right now. Or Han Solo. No. No, you're not. And this is the Millennium Falcon, huh? Rip, tell your crew to let us board, and I will happily save them. But either way, we are taking the Wave Rider. Take the damn deal, Rip. A captain never surrenders his ship. Hmm. Besides, Mick may turn sides, though. He wants outrun Kanjar Ro himself. Who's Kanjar Ro? Engaging protocol now, Captain. <laughs> I wasn't talking to you. You got all kind of key phrases. Oh, invisibility? What the hell happened to him? We're following a holographic projection to let the wave riders slip away. Oh, whoa. You could very clever, Captain. That is nice. In the brig. I figured that was it. Until Mick stepped in. And they didn't mess with me after that. Hmm. Yeah, it's He's back. been standing up for me ever since. Hmm. Let's just hope he's standing up for Rip and Jax now. Who else is going to take on those pirates? I don't know. Let's see what Mick does, y'all. I enjoy a good twist. So, hmm, let's see. Come on, Stein. You got this? <laughs> I'll teach you to mess with a nuclear physicist. <laughs> it's like a painter. <laughs> You bought the painted for castle or something. You'll punch me in the face, or burn me alive, or employ some other barbaric form of violence. That's why you recruited me, isn't it? To hit, hurt, and burn. No, I recruited you because you and your partner were a package deal. Damn. 
one. Ouch. Sorry, Rory, but a serial arsonist was never part of my plan to stop Savage, much less one with the IQ of meat. Ooh. I don't need to be so blunt. Shit. If I can just have a moment. Ouch. Then perhaps I can think of a way of getting us off this pirate ship. Damn. Vic is giving no fucks, man. I think I just beat you to it. Can anyone hear me? What the hell is this? I knew doing? it. Me and the pirates are gonna have a little parlay. Do not do this, Rory. Too late. What do you want? I want to speak to Captain Valor. About what? About a time ship. I am warning you. Shut up! Hmm. I may have the IQ of me, but I know how to cut a deal. All right, let's see. No, is this authentic or is this his, is this his plan? It's like a plan, like a, a double backstabbing betrayal plan. <laughs> Space Ranger, indeed. <laughs> Stein's having too much fun. He's the only person having fun right now. And Ray's about to be screwed. Ah. Who's going to save you? you? I wasn't. Ray! Hey! Stay with me! I'm afraid Mr. Palmer has gone into cardiac arrest. Damn. I can't lose you too. Ray, I need you, please! His chances of survival are less than 3,720. Shut the fuck up, Gideon. Oh. There he is. Should've gave him mouth to mouth. Fudging me in the chest. You okay? Mr. Palmer nearly died. Welcome to the club. <laughs> no help to you, Gideon. What's happening on the you okay, Mick? <laughs> I don't think so. Boys! Ship's all yours! Damn! He really going through with this. Yeah, come on. No gun. What you got? Ooh. Damn. Whoa. Rip, is that you? Hell no. Stunt double. <laughs> hmm. I did not want to see this, guys. Them two fighting against each other. Hmm. Ooh. Damn. No, he gonna pay for that. Hmm. Captain Hunter, we're in position. Rip. Captain he gotta have something up his sleeve. <laughs> Is he standing around? We're waiting for your Airlock? <laughs> Did I just hear the Wilhelm scream? These fools is tripping. You've proven that today. You're still one hell of a time master. Hmm. Which is why I'm giving you this. Ooh, software update. What's that? 1958. Thank you, Captain Baxter. I still don't understand why you're doing all this. Really? Before all this started, <laughs> I don't think I would have either. She's never loved we anybody before, I guess. History, safeguard time. You're pretty amazing. And I'm lucky to be your friend. Be mm -hmm. on this mission together with Okay, they are making something out of this. Pretty awkward when Carter comes back in the picture, but surprising. <laughs> All right, nice job, Mr. Palmer. You got that win. Okay, I'll handle it. By handling it, you mean murder? I said I'll handle it. Hmm. Damn. Are you serious? Does he have a plastic bag over his head? I, th I thought he was suffocating him and dragging him, bro. Whoa. Where are they either way? They didn't even explain this. I told you that would be the last time you hit me. Yeah. You were right. <laughs> you want to kill me? Kill me. Only one of us is 
walking out of here alive. You're right. What? Did he kill him? Nah, he didn't kill him, man. That's why they didn't show it, man. If, they, if he killed him, they would have showed it. They just wanted to leave it off on a cliffhanger, man. So, you got two characters that will be making a surprise return. <laughs> Rory, I mean, yeah, Rory and Carter, eventually. They'll probably be coming back because they both are still alive, all right? Tell me your thoughts about this episode down below, man. I can feel where uh, Mick was coming from, you know, felt betrayed and stuff. And the stuff that Rip said, you know, that really kind of, that really touched his soul, too. I, I even felt that one. So, <clears throat> he feel like, what the hell not? I got to do my own thing to get out of this. But... As, as far as the episode goes, man, they threw a lot of references out there to other shores, Star Trek, Star Wars, uh, Back to the Future. Thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy this episode, don't forget to hit me one of these. And I'll catch you next time, all right? Peace out.